Happening today, Travis McMichael, the trigger man in the killing of Ahmaud Arbery in Brunswick, Georgia, is expected to tell a judge whether he's going to stick with a guilty plea in his federal hate crimes case. Our Rebecca Schramm has been following this story and she joins us live this morning. The father, Gregory McMichael, ha has already withdrawn his guilty plea. That happened yesterday, Gravier. According to court filings I've been monitoring for the Southern District of Georgia, the son, Travis, is still on for a pretrial hearing today where he is expected to let the judge know his intentions. Uh, but yes, the, the father, Gregory McMichael, has withdrawn his guilty plea. Gregory McMichael is the one who initiated the chase of Ahmaud Arbery as Arbery ran through their neighborhood two years ago. Last weekend, we learned the father and son had agreed to a plea deal in the federal hate crimes case, but after hearing from the parents of the victim Monday, the federal judge rejected the punishment the prosecution had agreed to, which would have allowed the McMichaels to spend as many as 30 years of their life sentence in federal prison rather than state prison, which is considered to be tougher. With Gregory McMichael's withdrawal of his guilty plea, it means he is ready to defend himself on the hate crimes charges. Again, we expect to learn at a hearing today whether Travis McMichael, the son, will follow in his uh, father's footsteps or if he will, uh, will, will stick with his guilty plea. We know the third defendant, William Roddy Bryan, the one who recorded the shooting of Ahmaud Arbery, will stand trial. Jury selection begins on Monday. Live in Atlanta, Rebecca Schramm, CBS 46 News.